Hey guys, it's PBK and in this video I'm going to test out the battery on the new Moto Z2 Force. Motorola ended up putting a smaller battery in the new Z2 Force compared to last year's Z Force and they state that due to the new Qualcomm Snapdragon 835 processor they're running more efficiently and using less power, it will just last as long. Now keep in mind, last year's Moto Z Force had a 3500mAh battery compared to this year's Moto Z2 Force which has a 2730mAh battery. So here I have the new Moto Z2 Force on the left and last year's Moto Z Force on the right. Both have been charged to 100% and I'm going to play a movie on both of them from YouTube and see which battery holds up longer. Now also note that this Moto Z over here on the right is almost a year old and has been used on a daily basis, meaning the battery has gone through numerous charge cycles. Okay first, I'm going to go ahead and turn the phones both on and unlock them. I'm going to go into the settings, I'm going to go to the display, and I'm going to put the brightness level all the way up. Do the same thing on the new Moto Z2 Force. Okay, now we're going to open up YouTube. And we're going to go ahead and play this movie.
Now, as you can see, both of them are at 95%. So that's pretty good actually for the Moto Z2 Force that has a smaller battery and is lasting just as long as the Moto Z Force from last year that has a larger battery and is also an older phone that's been used on a daily basis. Okay, so now we're gonna go into the settings. The battery section. So in the battery section on the details, it says the new Moto Z2 Force is at 95% and the old Moto Z Force is at 94%. However, on the Moto Z2 Force, it says there's approximately only seven hours left of battery until the battery is empty. On the Moto Z Force, it says there's nine hours left until the battery goes empty. Now, I don't know how accurate that is because on the Moto Z2 Force, the battery seemed to last just as long as the Moto Z Force, uh, considering the fact that it has a little bit of a brighter display from what it looks like to me, and the fact that it has a smaller battery, I mean, I don't know. However, now if you look at it, it says approximately 10 hours left on 94%, compared to the Moto Z Force on the right, which is at approximately nine, nine hours left. So I don't know how it's doing these calculations, but that's what it's showing us. From what I can assume on the Moto Z2 Force, the processor is now allocating processes differently. So it's giving you more battery life, I'm not sure. I honestly thought the Moto Z2 Force battery was just gonna be a gimmick. The reasons they gave behind it lasting just as long for uh, compared to the Moto Z Force. I mean, I just didn't believe it. I had to t test it out on my own to make sure it's accurate. I'm just glad to see it is. For anyone else who was worried about the battery on the Moto Z2 Force, you can see it lasts just as long as the Moto Z Force from last year. So thanks again guys for watching. See you guys on the next video.